This is the magnificent Pyrenees, just above the spa town of Luchon. The peaks are around 3,000 meters high, and some of the farmers still manage to produce something very special. Sheep farmers, Christine and Robert Laurent, live in the picturesque hamlet of Artigues that stands at 1,250 meters high on the abrupt flanks of the Valley of Luchon. They raise a flock of over 200 ewes of the pure Tasconese breed to produce one of the testiest French lamb meats known as l'agneau des Pyrénées. During the day, the very docile lambs graze freely on the rich green mountain grass. Christine and Robert know by sight the name of each and every ewe of their flock and treat them admirably well, making sure they have a healthy lifestyle. In winter and during cool nights, the ewes come back to the bergerie sheds where they are housed in four different rooms. Surprisingly, they all know where they belong. What a magic moment. At the weekly Bannière de Luchon market, the local artisan specialties are in great demand. The local farmers make a delicious fromage de brebis fermier, used milk cheese from the farm, a big cheese of five kilos made with 25 liters of milk. The flavor is strong, but delicate and very fruity. A beautiful cheese. Contrary to most French regions where beef, chicken and duck are the most popular special occasion meats, here, lamb is a festive favorite. The locals love their meat on the bone and the lamb shoulder is the most popular cut in the Pyrenees. What they do, they rub it with olive oil, some local herbs, a little bit of cognac, a little bit of honey, let it marinate overnight and barbecue it. And they tell me the flavor is just amazing. The local specialty of lamb stew with beans is a perfect winter warmer and easy to prepare for a family. I first cook a little bacon and chop thyme in butter. Then I brown about one kilo of pieces of lamb meat all over for a few minutes before adding a diced brown onion and cook the onion for a few minutes. My preferred cut for this dish is from the lamb shoulder. I then add about a quarter glass of dry white wine and two diced tomatoes. Cover with foil and a lid and cook on low heat for about two hours until the meat is tender. Many years ago, this dish would cook all day in the fireplace. It's good to stir the stew a couple of times to make sure that the sauce doesn't catch. I add 400 grams of drained cooked white beans to reheat with the meat. Then I transfer the stew to a gratin dish. I sprinkle the top with chopped parsley and top generously with breadcrumbs. Then I place the dish on the hot grill for a few minutes until golden brown. It is so tasty and satisfying. The pistache de mouton is a great family dish. The region between the Dordogne River and the south of Limousin is extremely beautiful. And tomorrow we are going to discover that the local speciality is duck.